are up here in the uh, top of the Galantis building here in Dumbo. And, oh, and look that, they've got the carousel out. Well, this is the famous Jane's Carousel. And, uh, oh, look at this, we got a wedding party. This carousel has actually been undergoing uh, refurbishment for about the last five years, and uh, this is the first season that they've brought it out here in its new location down here on the beach in Dumbo. And this is a pretty extraordinary example of uh, carousel art. It's got something like 5,000 lights beveled mirrors, wooden horses. Some more uh, fresh graffiti up here. Oh boy, Smackdown! This is interesting. We've got uh, a little blast furnace here, and I think they might be uh, doing some cast iron. Well, and they got a lot of street art going on down here too. Well, now we get a chance to see the dancers perform on this apparatus. Now they've got a bunch of containers here that are set up by the international photo industries, they're calling them photopods. And each one of these are like a little gallery showing different uh, photographic techniques. A little light boxes. We're looking at George's Macus. like a uh, favela. Well, they've also got a lot of their uh, new food carts out here and uh, wow, that is a big dog. It almost makes this like a food festival as well as an art festival. Oh, now we've got a giant bubble machine. That's right. Eric Iota. Well, I was watching them set this up last night, and unfortunately, it was raining like hell. Oh, there's a good one. Oh! Looks like they finally got it tuned up today. Now we're going to take a look at some 
large drawings by Michael Ryan. And I was uh, impressed by these works. And not only are they large, but I uh, really like the surfaces. He's kind of stressed and worked on these things, collaged them together. And I like the, uh, I guess what I call kind of the, the meta drawing type of work that I see occasionally in Williamsburg. Uh, somebody's video projection which does kind of a time-lapsed repeat loop yeah. I've got some scroll drawings here by Chris Dominic video projection project in the tunnel under the anchorage of the Manhattan Bridge and this is by Leo Kolbs and it's entitled Immersive Surfaces and as I understand he's got a couple of million dollars worth of computers, programs, projectors and he's got a huge uh, support team that helped him put this together. I was in here watching this last night as they were working out some of the bugs and uh, yeah, it's amazing what you can do if you get a couple million dollars and some good technology to play with. Now they had to design this all so that it uh, fits the architectural frame that they're projecting this on. And I saw them in here with a uh, series of grids that they had projected. I think this this vaulted ceiling is probably about 40 feet high and uh, I don't know, 35 feet wide, maybe 150 feet long. Well, we're down here on the Brooklyn waterfront and they're in preparations for a Janet Biggs performance and I believe it's titled Wet Exit
Let me come 